I have some exciting, fun, exciting stuff to show you today. Back to my my best. Oh, it's so nice to be back with the froth. Love this. What kind of design did I make today? A moose. That's the. Oh my goodness, this is so gross. Okay, you want to hear a story about? I like jam the hell out of my thumb. It hurts so bad. I was at work. I was holding a box at work like this, and it, my hand was like wrapped around it, so it was like a wide box. And I was opening, it was for a client, and I was opening the office door, and I opened the door, and like my key was sticking out of the door with, with the same, it was in level with my thumb, and as I was like maneuvering into the office, I like hit the wall, and the wall like pushed me into my thumb, into the key, that was, it hurt so bad. Am I like giving you a good visual of this? It was painful. But yeah, if you didn't see my last vlog, we got outdoor furniture. I'm about to go sit out there with my coffee, but it's like really cold, so I need to put socks on. Put some socks and sweatpants on. Let's sit outside. But yeah, we got outdoor furniture if you didn't see my last vlog. I need a change, but <laughs> we're I'm gonna do these eye gels. It's so weird to, I just showed these in like a, my Thanksgiving vlog. I only showed them, I didn't say much about them. They're from Amazon. It's so weird to think about these because, so basically they're eye patches and they're snail repair intensive cold eye gel patch. I know there's like a perfume in it, so it's probably not the best. Nourishing and moisturizing filtrated snail mucus hydrogel eye patch with elasticity care. That sounds disgusting. Don't get me wrong, it really does. And I don't even know why I'm sharing this, but I love them and they're from Amazon. I'm almost done. I um, am gonna order more. This is something that I'm like repurchasing. I don't know what it is. These gel patches make your makeup look, go on so well. You could go out the night before and drink heavily and put these on and no one will know. There's like a decent amount and I think they're $15. They're always like selling out on Amazon. So whoever made these knows something that not everyone else knows because I love them. Just like a weird Amazon find, but I really like them. I don't know why, but I just thought it was unique. You know, very unique product. Okay, let's put some makeup on. It's too low. I need to change and I need to drink like a giant cup of, someone commented on my video because I was cutting a lime um, and a lemon on the counter with just like a paper towel and how it like mattifies marble. But this isn't marble, this is granite. Is that the same thing? But someone was like really rude. You don't want to cut lemons or limes because the acid from the lemons or limes um, like mattifies the marble, but this isn't marble, so is granite, like does it do that for granite? I don't know, my bad, I just get lazy and I just grab a napkin and cut the lime. And then they were saying how much water I used, cleaning my makeup brushes. It was just the whole thing and I was like, wow, I'm so sorry, but like how else do you want me to clean them? I just cut my lime on a cutting board. I've been loving lime water, but I need to chug this. Is anyone else like this? where um, since it's cold outside, you like don't drink enough water. I feel like I don't feel as dehydrated until the next day after not drinking a lot of water. I don't even think I have started off this vlog yet. Hi, hello. 
welcome back to my youtube channel i also want to say that so many of you guys are commenting such nice things on my videos a lot of people constantly commenting such nice things on my videos and i just want to say i appreciate that so much i do get some rude comments but the nice sincere good comments that i get totally outweigh those few bad comments so i just want to say thank you so much for taking the time to comment on my videos um to like my videos and um yeah it really does make my day i love waking up and seeing like a new comment or checking like a recent uploaded video or even like older videos that you guys comment on i still see those um comments so Thank you so much, I really appreciate it. It definitely does make my day. Anyways, I need to take this box to the recycling trash bin, whatever it's called, and I also need to go to my mailbox. I've had clothes sitting. I ordered clothes from Shein, and they've been sitting in my mailbox for a week. I don't know who I am. Usually I'm so excited to get stuff, but ever since I started like vlogging and doing YouTube, I always wanna like do it on camera and show you guys. So that's why. But I ordered a ton of loungewear and like comfy clothes, like winter edition from Shein. It's super affordable. Love their stuff because of how affordable it is and um, the quality as well. So I'm super excited to open up the bag and show you guys as well. And I was gonna show, I'm gonna show later today, I like posted a video and I asked if anyone wanted to see my Sephora stuff. I never want to come off as like showing it in your face, being like, oh, look at what I bought. That's why I do try and show like affordable stuff, like Shein, so affordable and I love the stuff personally. But the Sephora stuff, I not, like Sephora stuff is so not a need. Like you don't need to go to Sephora and like buy like expensive makeup, expensive like whatever. Some skincare I do like to invest in, but um, cause there, it's just like, it makes more sense to just spend the extra money on skincare and stuff. Anyways, I asked um, if you guys wanted to see some Sephora stuff and do a Sephora haul. And I think I'm just gonna show like a few of the things that I bought that I love and I'm repurchasing constantly. So I'm not gonna show like everything that I got, but I'm gonna show like a few items that like I literally can't live without and that I'm constantly repurchasing. So I'm gonna show that later today. <laughs> just to get a box in the car. <laughs> just to get a box in the car. I had to take apart my whole entire backseat just to get this in the car. I don't remember listening to this last night. Christmas vibes are here. quite a few things but the thing is is I got multiple of the same color in basically everything that I bought so a lot of basics everything will be linked down below let's begin with this so I got cropped crew neck got it in like a what kind of it, periwinkle color is that what you would call this I don't know it's like a blue it's I don't know what color it's really picking up but it's like a bluish purple so is that periwinkle? I got this in multiple colors because why not? I 
love wearing these with sweatpants to look a little bit more put together. I feel like wearing something cropped with sweatpants is nice. And I feel like when there's like a separation in what you're wearing, even if you're wearing sweatpants, I feel like it dresses it up a little bit more or makes it look more put together instead of like having like an oversized sweatshirt over top of sweatpants. Nothing against that, super comfy look. Um, but if you're like wanting to just dress it up a little bit, I feel like wearing something cropped with it dresses it up a little bit more. Let me know, could be wrong. I think I got it in white as well, which white is super classic. This is more creamy than white. What size did I get? Let me, so I got smalls. I got a small in this. And also I got it in white and I got a small in this as well can't go wrong with having like white I feel like um, it's just a good color and like I tried to branch out and get like some other colors other than black and white okay also got it in black because I don't have anything like this I don't have any like plain sweatshirts all of my crew necks or sweatshirts or whatever basically all have writing on them getting plain ones that you can Kind of like dress up you could wear these with jeans these are ten dollars and i used a coupon and it marked it down to eight dollars each so that's like so just cheap to me like this is so affordable it's not expensive at all and that's what i love about shein read the reviews i know the pictures that they pull are from like boutiques i think so it's not necessarily like you're getting the exact same thing in the picture it's something super similar but i always look at the reviews and the girls that buy the clothes are so good about posting pictures in the clothes or like posting pictures of the clothes so i feel like you can get a better idea of what you're ordering based on the reviews so if you like something just go to the reviews most likely there's like a picture of a girl wearing it but um there's probably a coupon code going on right now as well okay i'm excited about these because i got some like jogger sweatpants they're not thick material but they're this nice tan color they look like a nice material too high-waisted let's see okay yeah here's another color that i got i got it in this gray color i've never bought their sweatpants before so i wanted to try and i think these are all like the same sweatpant just different colors i don't know how these fit so i'm gonna have to try stuff on i got these in a small i think i got everything in a small and i got it in black tan gray and black so these were 17 dollars each but the sale marked it down to 13 so 13 dollars for joggers not the thickest material so if you do live somewhere where it's really cold out it's not the thickest but i mean you can always wear leggings underneath them i think i accidentally ordered two of the same top color i'll give one to my sister i guess i could return it but it's literally only seven dollars and who knows what return shipping's like These little sweater things they can be like worn off the shoulder i got these in a couple colors they're cropped but i thought these would be so cute like you can lounge in these and you can dress them up so i got it in black and I got two in black, so I'll just give one to my sister, I guess. I got these in an extra small. I got it in gray. Here's like a better picture of it, I guess. See, it's not that, it's not the thickest material, but um, got it in gray too. And these tops were $9, but the sale marked it down to $7.20. And I also got it in this like tan color. So tan, gray, and black is kind of sheer, so just wearing like a regular bra might not be enough. So just wearing like, I don't wanna like flash you. So I like wear these little bra things underneath like everything all the time and they're comfy. So just wearing it under this would work too. Um, I got some nicer cropped tight tops. I got these in a small. This I think was one of the cheapest things that I got. This was originally $6 and I got it for $4.80 and it's just like a black long sleeve a little crop they're just great basics to have on the trend of buying everything in like a different color i got it in white as well it's perfect i need to go try it on it's the gray top on see and it like looks cute with this like poking through a little bit i don't know you could like dress it up wear it with like a cuter one obviously or dress it down like this so I'm actually really glad I got them in a small. I think 
They look so cute. I'm never disappointed, honestly, when I order from Shein. Never. Do you die? They're so cute. I feel like you can get a better picture, I guess, of these, of like how loose they are. Here's the, it's, it's obviously wrinkly, but um, so cute. That's the haul. I'll be wearing this stuff on repeat, so don't judge me for constantly wearing the same thing. It's a lot later in the day. I wanted to show you some of the stuff that I got from Sephora that is stuff that I am constantly repurchasing. They're my favorites, absolute favorites. So first is this Isle of Paradise self-tanning drops. I get the medium. I've never tried the dark, but for the winter time, I feel like the medium would be fine. I love these. This is my third bottle. It lasts forever. You just mix it in with some lotion and you sleep with it on. Definitely wanna try the dark for summertime, but I really do like this. It gives you like a nice glow and just like evens out your skin tone. It looks so good. Next are these peel pads. I've been using these for so long, years and years and years. They are so good. This is the extra strength. There's one that's also not as strong, I believe. I just get the extra strength. I use it one to two times a week and it's enough. It makes such a difference. It's so good. It's kind of pricey, so this is definitely an investment. This is definitely one of my go-to favorites. Love it, constantly repurchasing. And this is Summer Fridays Jet Lag Mask, Holy Grail. I sleep in this mask when I need it. Sometimes I use it as a moisturizer if my skin is extra dry. It's amazing. I bet if you kept it in the refrigerator, it'd be so nice too. It's cooling, absolutely amazing. This is definitely one of my Holy Grails as well. So these are my top three favorite stuff that I purchased from Sephora. Um, I just wanted to share it, let you know my favorites. I will link this stuff down below for you just in case you wanna check it out. Definitely my favorites. If I had to recommend some products, I mean, this isn't obviously a necessity, but this is just something that I'm repurchasing all the time. This I love. I, I can't live without, like I sleep in this mask at least twice a week just to hydrate give myself like an, my skin an extra hydrating boost because i do use retin-a and this is just such a lifesaver when it comes to dry skin since it's about to be winter and our skin's about to dry up even more because of the weather this is so good let me know some of your holy grail sephora products in the comment section please i would love to try out more things expand on my beauty and skincare so yeah just let me know i'm putting on a big sweatshirt because we're going to kobe's steakhouse for dinner it's like hibachi but i wanted to put on like a big sweatshirt because i'm wearing a cropped one and i want to eat a lot of food and just in the mood to indulge just wearing an oversized sweatshirt and Christian actually got this sweatshirt for me when he went to Colorado last year I think so I love it <laughs> he got it for me I love um, traveling to places I mean obviously not that much anymore because COVID but I love traveling to places and getting sweatshirts as souvenirs so this is from Christian's trip to Colorado it's been a little bit and I've just been watching YouTube videos and doing way too much laundry so that's what Sundays are, laundry days basically. So that's what I've been doing.